Hello guys, welcome to another part of our course and uh, in this particular part we are going to be working on the course result okay so uh, the course result is very similar to the search course okay and uh, we already have some components that we will just reuse so this is not going to take a lot of time now let's go ahead and then uh, just copy this rule first Control C and uh, we're going to create another uh, page click on there to create page and here we'll say cause results okay this is going to be the screen where that will show the result of a particular search search item okay so uh now we are going to just go ahead and bring in what we have here although uh we're going to delete a lot of things so let's say uh, i would have just duplicated the other screen so let's say i would have just duplicated this screen actually Yes, that's what we would have done, but it's okay. Um, now we can just go ahead and uh, let's see. We need a text. We need these, so let's just go ahead and create this. I'm copying this 400 by 14. Uh, let's go to search course or course result. Yes, and then click on the column. Click on add a child to the main uh, column. And then here we're going to add a text widget. And uh, there you go, paste. And uh, here is going to be a padding of 17. Mm -hmm. So we have here 17. And then uh, it's definitely, for, then it's going to be like, uh, okay, okay, let's, uh, let's change our strategy, all right? Let's wrap this uh, row inside a container. So we're wrapping this entire row inside a container. It's going to have a maximum width. It's going to have a height of maybe 900. Okay. And so uh, now this row, okay, let's click on it and ramp this row in a column. Okay. Fine. And then now let's click on the column and give it the 17 uh, pixels padding. And um, let's see what is happening here. This is like 30. I want us to have the same thing. So let's give here 17 too. And then here, okay, not on that, let's give it to the column. So if you click on this and check this, it says 25. So we're giving it to the column, 25 pixel from the top. And then here, uh, we need to add another uh, search item here, All right? So let's go ahead and click on this and say Control D to duplicate what we have here. Click on the row and use this particular alignment that spreads them on both sides. And then let's copy this and uh, click on these to paste it and then we will go ahead and click here change this to this beautiful well it's still so not uh, light enough so let's try um, let's try this one uh, it's too to not good uh, let's say ascent no that one disappears totally and then international Mm, not working so let's use a secondary text and let's make fade a bit maybe something around here okay so we have this let's click on um, let's go ahead and add this particular detail so we can go here and say search course and copy the card so we click on here and copy the card Control C go to cost result no cost result click on the column and paste it there you go so we have that now um, this particular container has a color we should have copied it and uh, let's click on this container and paste it so i'm pasting this here this gives it this color now i'm perfect now observe there's some things that are not perfectly arranged anymore like uh, this is supposed to be like 400 by 10 uh, and then it's actually going out here um, what I would rather do is click on this, click on the container instead of that. Okay, we're giving it an infinite width. Okay, okay, okay. I see the problem. Let's remove this. Yes, now that's perfect. And then we don't even need this either. Okay, now this is now purely perfect, right? So um, let's go ahead and click on the container. See how we can give it some padding from the top. It's 10 pixels from the top and say 10. And then now that we have done that, let's click on cost result. No, the column itself, right click. Okay, hold on. 
let's see do we have anything here okay we do still have um, the search part here so let's uh, wrap this column in um, in uh, in a stack and then let's go to search course and bring in what we have here so click on this and control C to copy go to course result and um, locate the column the main column uh, and this is it so we click on the stack now and paste it and so it's now here and so the next thing we need to do is wrap this stack with a container that will make the entire background white so we click to give it a maximum width and a maximum height and that's it that's it my friend it looks great now so we click this to duplicate and go and go and go okay so this is it so this is how the result will look like when someone searches for something now let's click on the container and give the container a border of 30 okay and so that's it now we have this beautiful shape above beautiful guys so we have been able to finish working in this in a few a small amount of time so we are going to continue in the next video see you soon